Meanwhile, Minister of State with responsibility for Carnival, Ellison Adams, is calling for a closer working relationship between Calypsonians and the CDC. Adams says if the festival is to be a success, all parties involved would have to unite for the common cause. I don't think that there has to be any anxiety. And further, um, the CDC has not paid the, um, let's say about 11, 12 or 13 of the Calypsonians because when people are saying that the artists have not been paid, it's not all the Calypsonians in Antigua. They're just referring to those who enter the the final of the Monarch competition, the Monarch competition and the, uh, the mass band and so on. So it's not everybody. Adam says it is a fact that the major challenge faced includes late payments to artists and service providers. However, some monies have been paid. I know that there are a lot of people who are agitating, uh, complaining about the registration. I do not, I'm not really thinking about it. I think there are other things that have to be done first. And one of the things that has to be done, done first is ensuring that the rules and regulations are in place. It does make sense that people come out to register and then they're not given um, the rules and regulations governing the, that particular competition. Mm -hmm. So although it, 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 the time for registration is on, it, it, the festival's office is not pushing for that as yet. 